What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Jermaine because you back another banger. In today's video, I'm gonna be showing y'all how to clean the I was finna say Yeezy, bro. The Balenciaga mode slot, you feel me? And uh Yeah man, so here we have it. The Balenciaga mode slot. Looking at these now, it's gonna be hard letting these go. They look good, but they're not really good on my feet. Plus it's other things that I could get besides these. So without further ado, let's get straight into this video, man. Let's get it. So it's not really, like I said, I didn't wear these like that either. It's just the bottom a little dirty, you know what I'm saying? Nothing too crazy, but I'm gonna show y'all how to clean them anyway. Get y'all an idea of what to do. Y'all don't know how to clean y'all shoes by now. And uh. Yeah, so we're about to make our way in here. I don't need the box, so I'm gonna just put the shoes in here. Flip on the switch. Now, I recommend, you know, you can use the water that you already have from earlier. No more than twice. No more than two to three times, then change the water. And really only twice, depending on how dirty the shoes are. But since the first pair of shoes wasn't that dirty, that's the only other reason. That's the only reason I'm uh, still using the water from earlier. But um, after I clean this pair, I'm gonna change it up and clean some more pairs. So just to get out a sneak peek of all the uh, shoes I need to clean. Um, I definitely I'm gonna clean them uh, A Lick shoes next because those are really dirty. I'm gonna clean my Ultra Boots and then I I need the ah. Uh, don't need to clean them, I don't think. But I just need to clean the Ultra Boost. And the Ultra Boost, I really don't need, need to clean for real either. I might just end up throwing them in the machine. So the only thing I'm gonna clean next is the Alix. So stay tuned for that. And we about to get straight into cleaning the Balenciaga motor slides. So let's get straight to it. All right, guys, so the more I look at this, slide the more i realize it's more of a like collector's piece you know i personally don't think i would want to wear these even though i would i was trying to this is more like a collection piece and a cup but since we already got the water all we really got to do is get to cleaning so i really don't want to get my shirt dirty so i'm just show y'all the point of view of me cleaning the show the sneaker Take the shirt off. I can zoom in. I'm pretty sure it is. So what I'm gonna do is zoom in some more. Hopefully the angle not that bad. Okay then, I'm straight. It's just showing that, so all I gotta do is wipe it. So I'm just cleaning the outside, really. The outer shell, then you go into the inside. Ain't too much to really clean though. Cause it'd be the, the only thing with, with these, the most important part would be the bottom. So that's when you really gotta get the scrubbing. So other than that, these be cool. You know what I'm saying? Especially when it comes to cleaning. So just make sure you're cleaning each shoe good. And I would think these would be like, you know what I'm saying? It's really the upper. Because as y'all can see, look how wide the bottom is, bro. Like, this is really a W sneaker, but, like, I probably, honestly, would, would prefer the slip-on version better. But, bro, this mold slide is so good. Don't nobody got these either. Nobody. 
But I gotta uh, start rotating my collection because I, I can't keep buying stuff and not like making space for other stuff. Not only that, just uh, getting money back for some of that stuff because a lot of that stuff I really don't even wear. So my bad, so I'm just giving it a look. Detail, massage, circular motion. Now, honestly, sometimes you can let it sit. I know I didn't let the shoe sit in the other video, but in this one, I'm gonna let the shoe sit. You know what I'm saying? Let all the soap just soak in. Then I'm gonna wash it off. Sometimes it's good to let the shoe sit. You know, soak up all the cleanness, let all the dirt soak up. Even if it's not that much dirt, it's good to let it soak in. No, this does not damage the shoe. This is you actually taking care of your shoe by doing this. And my bad if y'all, uh, the angle kinda wrong on me cleaning. I keep forgetting I got it zoomed in. But um, honestly, since I'm done with this, uh water to make it extra clean or whatever. Uh, wash my hands off, wipe around the edge, you know what I'm saying? Make sure if whoever you doing this, you clean up after yourself, you know what I'm saying? Common courtesy. So we're gonna rest the bowl out and get a truck for the last video of the day. Because I'm gonna do the uh, last. So I'm gonna clean one more shoe and then I'm done. The rest of the two I'm gonna just wash in the uh, washing machine. But um, all I'm gonna do is rinse it off. All I'm really doing now is just rinsing it off. You know what I'm saying? Make sure you rinse it off good. and then drying it. And so it's good to use hot water, you know, really gets all the dirt away and sanitizes the shoe. Make sure you shake it off. And I'm gonna wash this one, but I'm gonna leave it in the sink until I'm done drying up the other one. Now, honestly, I think our job here is done. So, with that being said, we about to go ahead and draw the, um, what I was gonna say? About to go ahead and draw this one. So as y'all can see, it's got water on it right now. But watch this, once I'm done drawing it all the way. The bottom looks good as well. So you know what I'm saying. I might have, I might air dry this some more. I mean, put it under the fan, but we'll see. Cause I really want to wash the other, the other one too. Yeah, what? Oh yeah, if y'all listen to underground music, let me know in the comment section. Let me know what y'all think of that new uh, Destroy Lonely song. So this is how it look. Let me go back to one. This is how it's looking. Like, kind of like the final product. Looks pretty much brand new. It really, it really is, cause I really didn't wear these like that. Like I forced it at times, but like, you know what I'm saying? I just need to uh, get water out but since it's so thin i'm gonna let it air dry so but the bottom is pretty much clean besides that water in there so i'm gonna let these air dry you know what i'm saying little markings right there on the hill but these are pretty much new you know i don't wear them at all bro every time i try to wear them ended up not working out but i just put it on just for because of it, bro. Like, you feel me? It don't work out, like. 
every time I look at it, I'll be like, dang, these look nice. But when I put it on, it's a whole other story, so. Oh well, it's not meant to be. But, we're about to dry this other shoe off. And once I'm done doing that, we're gonna get into the next video. But let me know, and I know I wash it in the bathroom, bro, I know, I know. It's just better. Sometimes I wash it in the kitchen. That's what I might do in the next video. Well, no, I don't really feel like it. But, um, I'm about to, I'm drying off this other, the right side now. And I'm gonna let these air dry completely, of course. But this is just an idea of what it should look like. And then during the next clip, it'll probably be a, a, a V-roll of how it look completely dry. So just stay tuned for that. And uh, as y'all can see, that's how we looking. So just let the bottom dry, turn the fan on max. And these are drying like five minutes. So if you guys enjoyed this video, man, if this video was helpful, give it a thumbs up. If you guys want to support also give it a thumbs up if you guys like this video also give it a thumbs up if you don't it's okay because i appreciate you guys watching anyway but i'll see y'all in the next video and i'm out bro Bang in.